Hello, this is Nick from ReviewOutlaw.com. Today I'm going to show you how to pick the new iPhone 6 that you're hopefully going to buy. So if you're like me, you have an iPhone 5S. Um, the thing is the 5S and the 5 really hasn't changed size in the last, really since it came out. Um, so now we kind of get to the point where we have the new sizes, the 5 or 5S, the 6 or the 6 Plus. And it's, it's quite a, a difference in size. So what I'm going to show you is first thing you want to do is go to ReviewOutlaw.com, uh, click on my website, I'll put a link in the show notes, but I'll give you a link where you can download a PDF and then you're going to basically want to print um, this little PDF I have. And that's going to give you an accurate size of each of the phone, the 5, the 5S, and the 6 Plus. And then what I recommend you do is just take some scissors, cut these phones out, and we've done this. And so now what I have here is the 6 and the 6 Plus. Um, then what you want to do is just take some cardboard, right here, trace the phone on the cardboard, and cut out a little piece of cardboard. But this will give you just a nice backing so you can get an idea when you're holding the phone, um, you know, how does it feel, if you're holding it with one hand, if you're clicking the icons, which you would normally do, how, how can you kind of reach out if you're putting it in landscape mode, doing it with two hands, and you can compare that uh, versus the large, the, the plus, which is five and a half inches, versus uh, 4.7. You can compare these two and see how it's gonna feel. Also, you might wanna just put it up next to your ear to see how big does that feel if you're wearing armband, exercising, see how that's gonna look or feel. Just putting it in your pocket, something that you do every day to kind of take for granted. But see how that feels in your pocket. Um, that's going to give you a much better idea of which phone you want to do. The only main difference between the two phones is the size, being 4.7 and 5.5 inches diagonal, and then battery life. Um, there's a, a significant increase in the battery life, and I'll put the details in the, in the notes on Review Outlaw exactly the differences there. But um, there is quite a jump in, in the larger phone, you can have a much longer battery life. So if battery life was an issue before, uh, on the 5S for you, that might be something you want to consider. Um, so yeah, that basically uh, rounds it out. So again, go online, print this out, cut it out, and then get some cardboard so you can get a good size idea. Um, and I look forward to getting the new iPhone 6.